the San Zero. I'm your match commentator, Derek Ray, and ready to provide expert analysis alongside me is Stuart Robson. And we're ready for UEFA Champions League group stage action tonight. It's Inter up against Benfica. Well, they may already be through, Derek, but they'll just want to finish top of the group. It might just give them a better chance in the knockout stages. Away from home, this won't be easy, though. The Inter starting lineup. Jan Zoma is the goalkeeper. Hakan Chalhanolu starts alongside Nicolo Barella in the centre of midfield. And as for the attacking tandem, Alexis Sanchez plays alongside Lautaro Martinez. And this is how the starting 11 looks for Benfica. Joao Mario starts with Angel Di Maria on the flanks. And the story in attack is one of a strike partnership. Accurate pass upon accurate pass. And moving the ball forward with genuine purpose here. So here is the table, and I was having a chat with some of the away fans ahead of kickoff. They're so buoyed by their performances over the last few games in the group stage, they know they could rubber stamp top spot, Stuart. Well, they've been excellent so far, but they're going to need help from the other game if they're to clinch top spot today. All they can do, though, is play well and win this one. Really good wide play. Well, he knows what he's doing defensively. Rafa. And a goal kick will be next. Well, if you're charged with the task of keeping tabs on Lautaro Martinez, you had better do your job diligently. What do you expect to see from him today? Well, Derek, he's brilliant in the air, so expect crossing to be a big part of their game plan today. Making the pitch big, getting the ball out wide, and deliver as many crosses into the box as possible. Martinez. And unable to keep possession. Dumfries. And it crossed the byline. A goal kick as a result. Joao Mario and a fine tackle likes to run with the ball at his feet and fine goalkeeping Taken short. Baba. And just wide of a target. Goal kick. Well, I think the goalkeeper had it covered, but it was a decent effort, though. What a Mendy. And Inter have it once again. Aursnes. Joao Mario. Well, it could be on for him here. Oh, a smart stop. Well, no danger now. Augusto. with Chalanolu. He read the situation defensively and did his job. Joao Mario. Alexander Bach. Martinez. 
Now, counter-attacking possibilities here. Opportunity to deliver the cross. Well, not of a mind to take any chances. Tipping that one over. Well, an opportunity here for them to get their noses in front from the corner. Playing it short. Pulls it back. Can they create something? And it's gone in from Alexis Sanchez! That will give us team a left, the first goal of the contest. Well, it's a very simple finish in the end, but his movement was really good. He just found himself a bit of space in the box when it mattered most. again what sort of response will we see from them now Aursnes and with it Joao Mario Otamendi Joao Mario excellent refereeing advantage in operation Cook Chu moving the ball nicely looking for that final pass really good diving save now well, following on from the previous incident, he sees yellow now. And there's the delivery. Nicely saved. Another corner. Stop them in their tracks. Rafa. This could level it. Oh, but the keeper with an important save. How important is that? Well, he should score from there. That's a wasted opportunity. He should beat the keeper from that sort of distance. Trying to deliver it accurately. And a goal! Real excitement here, the equaliser! Well, here it is again. It's a well-delivered ball into the box, and it ends up with a fairly simple finish. Certainly not much the goalkeeper can do about that. Underway, level pegging, one goal apiece in this game. That's a good ball. Well, goal kick, just as it was looking promising. Barella. The ball with Martinez. Alexis Sanchez. 
And there we have it, the half-time whistle. Well, not quite the performance we were expecting. As it stands, it looks like the battle for top spot will go down to the final game. Yeah, they haven't been at their best today, but I'm sure we'll see a much improved second half from them. They'll want to get the job done today, that's for sure. So the second half gets underway. Almost a case of the two teams saying to each other, whatever you can do, I can do just as well. Martinez. And there it breaks down, but credit to the defence. Di Maria. to do a bit of damage and held by the keeper at the second time of asking well he's just pulled off a great first save there now they can all calm down Dumfries this man will get most of the plaudits for his contribution up to this point Stuart well I really liked his first half display he was certainly the most influential player on the field and I'm expecting more of the same in the second 45 minutes Well, there was impending danger, but good defending. Promising position here for Di Maria. Kukchu. Well, that takes the wind out of their sails. Great defending. Florentino. Can he make it count? Oh, he couldn't outwit the keeper. And fired over by Angel Di Maria. Clearance left a bit to be desired. Oh, a tremendous block. Well, we're into the final half hour. Chalanolu. Barella. Inter in a position of menace. Chalanolu. And a passing sequence that's easy on the eye. And quick thinking defensively. Barella. Can they forge ahead? No! Chance missed! And a big chance at that, Derek. He should have put them in the driving seat there. So deciding to make a personnel change at this juncture. Well, the stats make it pretty clear. Inter have looked a real threat going forward, but their shooting has been really poor. Let's hope they don't regret those missed opportunities come the end of the game. High pressing at its best. Aursnes. Attacking with vigor. And whipped into the box. For Inter, ball lost. Di Maria likes to get on the ball. And he has teammates to pass it to. A disappointing end to the move. Chalanolu. Teammates available. Had no intention of losing out. Just unable to get his cross beyond the first defender. Otamendi.
distributing it well. He's waiting in the middle. This could have possibilities. So it's going to be a goal kick here. So two substitutes to come on in one go. Good work from Inter to win it back. Mendy. Arthur Cabral. Di Maria now. Uh, on the scent of a winner late in this game. And credit is due for that good piece of defending. And the tackling like that, the onus is on the referee to take action potentially. And a yellow card, it's going to be Stewart. Yeah, the ref's got that right. It's a yellow card all day long. And with play stop, they will make the change now. Arnautovic just the challenge that was required Aursnes all even but will it stay that way Di Maria it looked as though they had attacking momentum but not so De Frey. Really good challenge. Martinez. And read perfectly by Otamendi. So two minutes of stoppage time here. And a good-looking ball. Di Maria keeps going. Joao Mario right towards the near post. And the referee's whistle. That is the end of the story. Well, he caught the eye at times in this particular match, didn't he, Stuart? Well, he just didn't affect the game enough today. What he did, he did quite well, but he wasn't that involved.